Hey guys, DJ here. Welcome to today's video. It is collection series part 10, episode 10. Okay, please. I know if you've been wondering, like, what happened to those videos where he did collection series? Like, what happened? Honey, she disappeared and... I just been forgetting to do it and it takes time to gather the items together um if you're wondering about this face and where some of the products came from um i just did my video on um from my friend tori her brand beauty effects by tori g that video should be already it'll already it's already you're watching this it's already posted then the look was brought to you by uh, anastasia and ravina too i'll show you you'll see you'll know if you watch the video you'll know um, yeah, before we get started, let's go ahead and get subscribed and like the video and let's just go ahead and start talking about part 10 of collection series, which is all about, uh, eyeliners, eyeliners, honey. That's today's video. Let's get started. Bam. Let's get started. <sighs> so exhausted. Iggy eggs. So I say let's start with eyeliners. This goes from like liquid liners to eyeliner pencils all over. It's like literally the same. Um, so yeah, let's get started. I'm going to start with my liquid liner. So I have one liquid liner that's a um, brush tip. So I'll start with the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid liner. I love this liner. The girl... Oh, see, it opens on that, and I forget. That's where the product is. Here's the brush applicator. It's literally, like, black. Like, it's so black. It's not sheer in the slightest, like, literally, look. It's so black. It's so good. Helps you get a precise line. It doesn't dry so fast. Um, got Mick. From Drag Race, Legendary Queen, in my mind, my winner, uses this eyeliner. So I'm like, um, I'm doing something right. <sighs> yeah, that's that. Amazing. This retails for 20 something. I got this in the Anastasia Sultry Palette Vault. So that, that was a deal. This is amazing liner. I really like it. Um, now we're going on to felt tips. Now this is a very popular one in the beauty community. The House Labs Liquid Eye Liner. This is nice, the shade Punk. It's literally a matter than matte liquid eyeliner. So there's your felt, felt tip applicator. It's very popular, like, let's do this one right here. Black, black, like, no streakage, no breakage. It doesn't bleed either. It stays where you put it, and it stays on. Love this. It's like 20 bucks, I think. I got it on a sale. Sorry, I got it on a Black Friday sale. But um, this is an amazing black eyeliner. If you're new to eyeliner, I would say start with a felt tip, then go to liquid, because once you're comfortable with this, you can then go ahead and get the liquid one with the brush tip, and you'll be able to just do it. I didn't do any today. Ugh. Sorry, pause. This watery fucking eye. Ugh. Uh, you see that breakage right there where it's messing up my face? You can't see it from here, can you? No. That's awesome. Now, buy a, this one, the one size point made liquid eyeliner. <sighs> I never meant to have this, but they had a sale going. Uh, buy this, any purchase of like 20 something or more and you get a free setting powder. Oh, I gave it to somebody. Um, yeah, I was like, ooh, a full size setting powder, free. I'm like, that's a good deal. They sent me the tiniest thing, but I bought the eyeshadow palette the, and the liner was like $40 some dollars. Good deal. But like, I kind of was like, I don't want this. But when I used it in one of my videos, not one of the videos, or one, did I do it in a video? I forgot. I did a face and I used this liner and it looked really good. I really liked it. I mean, pretty red packaging, nice and black too, just like that. Like, it's nice. This stays in place too. It's very comparable to the house labs one very comparable um i think this is 20 something as well look at me i don't even know my prices bitch just google it google it whatever that's one size patrick stars brand it's so good and now ColourPop, the liquid the bff liquid liner no is it the bff it's just the ColourPop liquid liner yeah this is the shade graceland it's white so like look 
it's literally white. So if you want to get creative with that, you can, I've used this before against other colors like of line so I can like make it up here sharper and it used to get covered in color, but it's good now. I had to clean it, but it's good now. This is like $8 and I mean, I mean, it looks a little sheer at first, but you can build it up. It's like, it's already drying. I can literally build up the coverage easily easily build it up those are all my liquid liners i have my one from pure from the grinch collection i don't know where it is i don't know where that bitch is and i'm not gonna look for it but those are really nice ones so if you want a, um, a more affordable one this one comes in plenty of colors they have it in black so go for that but then i have my bougie ones I'm not sorry all right let's go to eyeliner pencils now let's so we're already talking about color pop the ColourPop Cream Gel Liner. So minus this white one, these three came with the Raw Beauty Christie ColourPop Collection, and these are lovely. Love, love, love. I'm gonna use this other hand. So this shade is called um, Spare Time, like time like the herb. So like, literally gorgeous, like hunter green, hunter forest green. You can literally use this, and it, um, if you had a brush, you can literally buff that out and use it for like liner right there and buff it out you can put on the lower lash line buff it down the brown shade is called woodsy and this is nice and brown so for like so like for a more natural day so that one's really nice too and then we have the kitty oh, he's probably gonna open the door let him open the door go and get you got it buddy go go open the door he's opening the door himself you can go go and then we have this yellow one, it's called Marigold. And it's very yellow, look at that. It was looked so good in the waterline. You can go, buddy. He's gonna jump all over my stuff. You can open the door, do it. Look at, look at, look at. Look at this, look at this, look at this boy. He's opening the door, good boy. Go. He's literally, a guys off camera shenanigans he's literally he's he's he'll get out you can do it boy you can do it he's opening oh y'all he's crazy um let's go into the white one this one actually just came in um i got this with a palette so this white one he's doing it he did it he opened the door he is so good um that's the white one see how white that is see <clears throat> it's like literally white um, I had gotten the, I was really just trying to get the Kathleen Light So Jaded palette, which is gorgeous, by the way. I used that for something else I used it for, but I bought this with it too, that white one, because I was always wanting to try it. But, um, those are the ColourPop ones. They're really good. Now let's get, let's stick with Drugstore. This is the Milani Metallic Lights Foil Eyeliner Pencil. Girl, if you want blue in your waterline and you want it just to look amazing, this is like, it's like a navy metallic. It's has that nice glitter in it. It is so beautiful. This is like $7, six or $7. And just literally, it's just, if you don't want black and you want a color, I'm telling you that right there, it's stunning. And do I have any other drugstore? No, I don't. Now we're going into Bougie. Let's go to House Labs. The House Labs eyeliners. I did a video with featuring these and I ended up using this one called Grime. So let's do it. See, House Labs Identify Gel Eye Pencil, let me tell you. Actually, let's wipe off these liquid liner swatches because they're just sitting there. Oh. Literally, I am wiping. Oh, and now they come off. At first, at first, they girl, they didn't want to come off at first. I'm telling you, some of those you really got to work with it with a makeup remover, and then they'll come off. Let's go ahead and do this green. Remember when I was struggling to sharpen them? You do, you just they'll sharpen. <sighs> you just got to really work it. It'll feel like you're gonna break it, but you're not. But um, on a clean hand, this is grime. Look at how y'all know I love my green shadow. Look at that eyeliner. Like, I saw this when it was released. And I was like, I will own that color. I will own that color. And I own it, <laughs> bitch. Then I saw this other green that she had. 
This one was called Empire. And it's like the emerald metallic older sister of it. Ugh. Like that Milani one, that blue, if you're looking at them, it's like the emerald version and the navy version. So beautiful. And then the white one in Aura. Um, oh, I was using that on some colors. So like if I just like literally just do a weird swatch right here just to get that green off. And then do a... Ooh, it's there they are very creamy so they'll, they'll look like they're breaking but there's the white like that's really white honey it does look a little messy on there so you have to like kind of like work with it but um yeah really white awesome color let's go into urban decay <sighs> now i am i have the black one in my waterline i have this one right here the urban decay 24 7 glide on eye pencil in the shade perversion I do have this black one in my waterline. I can always count on my Urban Decay eye pencils. I can always count on them. Like, they don't ever let me down. Like, this was full. This was a full size. And it's like, I'm getting there. Now, the next color from Urban is, this is a new one. I'll still do a swatch. This is the this is my probably my favorite eyeliner pencil. This is what got me into eyeliner pencils. My friend Nikki at the Urban Decay counter, she suggested... I was like, if I want color on here without doing too much, what would I do? And she suggested this eyeliner pencil in Chaos from Urban Decay. Oh, it's a fresh one. A fresh Chaos. This. Oh, look at that blue. It's, I, this was on my waterline at all times, all the time. That blue. I always had it on. Like, like, oh, what eyeliner is that? Urban Decay. I'll just keep it out of the box now. Stunning, like, that blue, come on. But now you really want to get stunning, honey. Fenty, the Fenty Fly Pencil eyeliners. Oh my God, and these are twistable. Let me start with um the dark one and then I'll get to my favorite one because this one, this next one changed my life. So this is the shade... This is the shade C about it, like Ocean C, S E A about it, C about it. And so you twist it and it comes out. And then you can look, and then do a swatch right here. You gotta work with that one. But like, it's much more royal blue. Um, not similar to that, but it's more royal blue. So a little bit darker than Chaos, but like beautiful. And now let me show you the one that changed my life. Okay. So this is Lady Lagoon from Fenty. You see, the way I was with um, Chaos was the way I was with Lady Lagoon. Oh my God, girl. Look at that. As you can tell, these are my favorite kind of colors for the waterline, like greens, mainly blues. Oh my God. Here, if we put a little bit of, of Lady Lagoon and then we get a little bit of C about it. Put them right next to each other. Put them right next to each other. And then if you have like a little, I'm looking for like a brush here, this brush. If you have a brush that you can like buff with, literally you can mix. Okay, that maybe that brush was not good to use because it had um, highlighter on it, but like that, didn't work you can literally mix them just put, put the lighter one on then the darker one and then get a clean ended brush like that and smudge it and it makes another color but like <sighs> that's that um do i have any other eyeliners i don't i mean the morphe ones that i use for my lips you can use in the eyes as well they're just labeled as a color pencil but i just use those for lips um that's really it i'm looking at my stuff over here do i have anything else? oh where's the Guys, I'm a mess. Where is that brown one? Where? <laughs> it was here, you guys. I have a pure one that I really like. Oh, is that it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, <laughs> for, if you got the Robbie D. Christie Pure Collection, and it was a, you know, that was a mess of a launch, but they gave you a pencil eyeliner. And this is the Pure on, down, on Point Eyeliner. Literally, you it says sharpener, 
right there. So it literally, as you take it out, it sharpens it. It always comes out sharp, and this is a nice brown one. So I actually do like that pencil. So like, it's a nice dark brown, kind of similar. It's a little bit darker than that ColourPop one, but it's really nice. So literally, every time you put it back in, it sharpens. So that's pretty cool. I think that that's it for my eyeliners. What do we need to do next? We need to do mascara. We can do <sighs> lashes, I guess. Yeah, we can do lashes. Uh, brow products. We need to do brow products. So that's two more. This is already episode 10. So we need to do mascara and brow products. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's it for today's video, you guys. That was all about eyeliners. So thank you. Sorry again for being so late, but we are going to get better with that. That's it for today's video. Look at all those swatches. Now you see what kind of eyeliners I like. So if you want to know, this is what I like. But yeah, I want you guys to have a good day from wherever you are. And always stay fierce. Mwah. Goodbye, guys. Goodbye. I'm stupid.